so the next important subject is the network theory or network circuit analysis whatever it is you call in your university so kcl and kvl are the first important things you have to focus on network theory then moving to the theorems network theorems thevenin's norton's superposition are equally important you have to focus on two port network also this will be very handy while solving complex circuits during the interviews and online test next look into the response to various inputs to the circuits with combination of rlc so this is very important many companies directly ask questions including rlc circuits and uh, response to various inputs they can be step input or sinusoidal input so also focus on the rc transients transients are most important especially for the texas instruments these topics i have taken from the job description on the texas instruments itself next focus on second order rlc circuits and also their response to various inputs for second order rlc circuits you have different uh, damping conditions over damp under damp critically damped and under undamped look into the conditions for which the system is damped differently and also focus on lc circuits in steady state and their transients also see how to find the pole and zero of a given circuit and the contributions from both of them next uh, see how to find the transform from a given rlc network and uh, finding q factor poles and zeros of the given rlc network so these topics are very important especially for texas instruments so focus on these coming to the resources of the network analysis so again i have followed network analysis crash course by shankar sir in the creatix youtube channel this was a single point single place where i have completed my network analysis this is a very detailed course even though it is a crash course it will help you a lot and uh, i'm very thankful to shankar sir on this and uh, you can practice questions from india bigs and uh, get pyqs as i said earlier and uh, focus on different uh, platforms where you get different types of questions in where you find them online also if you want to refer some test books then you can refer to network analysis by van van kelberg and also circuit theory by hyatt and kamari and these are some more resources which you might not need but yeah i i recommend if you have time go do these two otherwise you just go with this this would be sufficient